Uh, hello everyone, my name is Daniel, I'm 30 years old and I live in Japan uh, working as a translator. See. Yeah, it might sound a little bit obvious, but I really think that Neymar, Neymar Santos is gonna be our best player this year. And as you guys know, he's very, he's fast and he's young, very skillful, has a very good ball control, he anticipates the opponent's moves very in a very intelligent way so I'm really my hopes are on him well when it comes to Brazil I'm very optimistic about Brazil I think although we don't have like many stars this year um, but I think this team I think Filippo is doing a very good job the team is very well connected, there is a very good, uh, like the way we are playing now, it's not only about good players playing in the same team, they're really playing, like really well connected, so I do think we have good, good chances to win this World Cup. About Japan, um, I'm not very sure. Although Japan now has uh, top players, players who are, good, who are playing in important leagues in the world, I just think that one problem is Japan is now in a kind of a difficult, uh, in a very difficult group, so maybe I think Japan is gonna have problems advancing to the next stage. Yeah, so maybe Japan is gonna finishes I think Japan is gonna finish his participation in the group phase unhappily I see I don't have a particular game because when it comes to World Cup I'm the kind of guy who wants to watch basically all the games even the not very uh, popular ones but I'm looking forward to watch the first game Brazil against Croatia it's gonna be uh, well, the first game of the event, and um, my my it's a, for me is a very like a big opportunity, a big chance to see a World Cup uh, taking place in my own country. So for me, it's gonna be really exciting. Yeah, of, of course, like I said, I'm really optimistic about Brazil winning this World Cup, but. I also think that teams like um, Spain, of course, uh, Germany, Germany is now with kind of a young team with very like strong players when it comes to the physical part. And also maybe Portugal, Portugal, of course they have Cristiano Ronaldo and uh, it's the kind of team who also has a good tradition so and maybe as you know Portugal and Brazil we have this kind of rivalry so probably Portugal is gonna I think he will have uh, the Portugal team is gonna have like a, maybe a special feeling uh, about this this world Cup. they will try to spoil Brazil's plan yes as much as they can that's my my feeling. Hi, uh, my name is Vladimir. I'm from Russia. I'm 27 years old and uh, I'm working towards my master's degree at the University of Tokyo. Well, I think it's Alan Zagoyev because uh, Russian national side is not so young, but Zagoyev is one of the few bright young players and he already had the chance to prove himself uh, a couple of years ago at Euro 2012. And I think that uh, this World Cup uh, it's uh, his chance. Uh, that's a tough one. Well, for Russia, more often than not, uh, it depended on psychological stability rather than football skills. And uh, once we clear uh, the group stage, then we can go quite far. But this time, even if we go to 1 8th, we're going to meet most probably either Germany or Portugal, and that's going to be a hell of a job to pass them. So, my prediction is uh, second round at best. And uh, about Japan, I think the same. They don't have too much experience in elimination rounds and second stage for the round for them will be quite hard too because it will be either Italy or England or Uruguay from Group D 
which was already dubbed as a group of death. So I don't think that they will go too far as well. I'm looking forward to games of all big teams, but uh, honestly I would like to watch Germany versus Portugal because I've been a uh, huge fan of Germany for a long time and uh, Portugal now is a wonderful team. They've got uh, this inspiring leader and when this passion meets the German machine, I'm sure it will be very interesting. Well, I think uh, it's out of the question, you know, the home turf advantage for Brazil uh, will be such a huge boon that uh, they already have a great team. And now when they have uh, hundreds of thousands of cheering fans, I think it's not a question at all. And Dark Horse, I'm really, I'm really hoping Germans will show what they really can do this time. And uh, I'm looking forward to them actually going to the final. I am Yuki Shinozuka. I'm a singer in Tokyo, Japan. Keisuke Honda, he is cool. And now he is playing Milan. He's good to change the game with his technique. I think Japan can go to S4, but it's not so easy because they have very good teams in World Cup. Games in Group D, um, Italy and England, I mean it's interesting to Europe now, and also Lazio and a game too. I really have no idea, uh, they are very good teams in World Cup, it's difficult to choose as for Dark Horse. Japan maybe